Okay, so I just tried to play the game NASCAR Heat Mobile on your phone for iOS and Android. Terrible. Do not get it. You think NASCAR Heat Evolution is bad? <laughs> no, no, no. Like, I downloaded it. For some reason, it got pop like, um, t it was taking forever to load and everything like that. I, can't, I tried to record my gameplay, but every time I record, it, it was recording, and all of a sudden the recording thing will disappear for some reason. Then, um, the actual gameplay, I mean, like, the menu and all that is good, but once you get to the gameplay, like, it's so laggy. Like, you're sitting there, and you're racing at Daytona. It takes about, what, 45 seconds to go around? It, I calculated it's about two minutes or, or, or so for me to complete a lap. So it's that laggy. And for like about a second, it won't be laggy. And then it'll go back to laggy and all that. And now I was like, um, on lap two coming to coming out of turn four, like the, the audio was still going, but the game froze. And I know the game was actually still going because I hear that I was catching up to the leaders and it's like my car started to slow down like I was hitting the wall. And like, you know, it was like I, I don't understand. So, and I saw that other people are having this problem. You could try it out yourself, but I recommend not getting it. And I like pretty much any NASCAR game. But the last two, on this phone and the Xbox, it's just really disappointing. I mean, you expect games to get better. I mean... I'm looking at Forza Motorsport 6 and Forza Horizon 3. Those are, like, the top games ever for, like, racing. And yet, you can't make a simple NASCAR game with a certain amount of cars. I mean, it's pathetic. I mean, I can understand it's a mobile game, but I've played better mobile racing games than what I was playing. And that's sad. Especially for a NASCAR fan like me. Do not get it. I, trust me. If you get what I got, then you won't understand. Just don't get it.